What's up guys, my name is Elias and in today's Sandrop tutorial we are going to go over all of the different features that Sandrop has to offer so that by the end of this video you guys are going to know how to use Sandrop. So to get started simply just head over to the link down below. The link down below is going to grant you access to my exclusive offer which I have going on with Sandrop which is going to give you guys a 7 day free trial, 50% off your first 3 months as well as $200 in order credits for completely free. You are also going to get a whole lot of other bonuses simply by just using the link down below. So to get started simply just put in your email address as well as your payment information. Once you have then successfully registered yourself as Sandrop account, you will be redirected onto this page where you will then have to connect your store. Now if you don't already have a Shopify store, I will leave you a link for a free trial down below. Either way, just put in your store address and just connect your store by using the Sandrop app. This is only going to take a couple of seconds and as you can see now I have been redirected onto the actual Sandrop dashboard. Right here we are then going to see an overview of the actual sales, costs and so on. So basically this dashboard section right here on the left will kind of work as a profit calculator. Now as I obviously just set up an example store, nothing shows up right here. However generally this is super useful to get a basic idea on how much money you are actually making. Then right here on the left we can see the find product section. This right here basically just is going to show off the Sandrop product catalog. Now Sandrop does actually have over 1 million products available in their product catalog which is pretty mind blowing given that most of these products are actually directly fulfilled by Sandrop which will actually allow you to get quite fast shipping rates on most of your products. Additionally Sandrop also does have a lot of US products available which are actually going to be shipped and delivered within 3 to 5 business days which basically is unheard of. Now, one thing which I do want to mention right away is that Sendrop is actually going to streamline your whole Shopify and dropshipping success by first of all allowing you to get started pretty easily, their, their whole interface is pretty self-explanatory and pretty intuitive. However later on once you are an established seller you can actually also work with them together to get even better profit margins because once you are a high volume seller Sendrop is actually going to reach out to their agents to their manufacturers and so on and they're basically going to negotiate better deals and better rates for your products and this is just something which you will have to keep in mind. Either way let's continue. Right here on the left you will then see the my products tab. So right here for example I have added two products in the past. We can then actually also see issues if there are occurring any. However let me now actually show you how to easily import your products onto Sendrop. So I will just click on find products and let's for example say that we do want to uh, we do want to import a sun lamp. In this case I'm just going to look for sun lamp right here. Actually let's just look for sunset lamp. I guess this is going to work better. And as you can see right away we do have quite a lot of different options available. Uh, in this case I'm going to go for this one right here. This does cost $2.42 and is actually directly being fulfilled by Sandrop themselves. So Rest assured the shipping times are actually pretty fast as you can see only 8 days. Now one thing which I actually don't really like about Sendrop is that they usually do have their product costs pretty low. However shipping is actually almost always going to cost quite a lot so in this case $5. Which brings the total price to $7.90. Now this still is super low and definitely industry leading. However this is just going to basically you will just have to keep this in mind when looking at different kind of products. So right here we can then actually then also change the country that we want to ship to to see different kind of shipping rates. But I'm not going to do that right now. As you can see we do have our different kind of variations right here. However I will just click on add to my products. Additionally you can actually also create a sample order so that you can actually get the product in hand. This is super useful if you for example do plan to create ad creatives on your own or if you do want to promote your product on TikTok for example. Either way once you have added the product to your list it is going to show up under my products on the left and then we can actually review and publish this. We will have to first of all set the product name then we can actually also first of all delete 
or actually change the product tags. We can actually also add new tags and we can set up the product type as well as collection. We can then change up the description, variants as well as images. Now one, basically one of the key reasons why I do like this review and publish feature is that actually these images right here are almost always super high quality and these are super professional. So just make sure to leave them in. You can always delete them later on and click on publish to my store. Then as you can see right here, uh, they do have this disclaimer uh, about the unit. You don't uh, make sure to just read through this, then click on confirm. And then after a couple of seconds, let's actually refresh the product tab. But here, this is going to be available. As you can see, we are going to have the same exact description and the media is also available and super high quality. Obviously, you would then have to further customize this by changing up the media a bit maybe, by changing the description and so on. But most of the time, SendJob does actually do almost everything perfectly. However, still, I would recommend you to once go through this to make sure that everything has been published to your likings, essentially. However, let's now actually continue and let's now actually head over to the orders tab right here. All right, so I just created an example order. As you can see, if we're now going to click on this, we can see what this person actually has ordered. And um, now this is actually going to have a total of $15. Once again, if you are going to use the link down below, you are going to get $200 in store credits for completely free. Either way, to now actually fulfill this order, you will simply just have to select that right here. And then you can click on bulk fulfill to actually select multiple orders. Additionally, you can just use this fulfill order right here here on the right. However, additionally, you can simply just select auto fulfillment right here. And this will basically just automatically fulfill all of the orders, saving you quite a lot of time because you don't have to manually go here and always click everywhere and basically it will just save you time. Then you're going to also see the unpaid section right here. And as for link or source, Basically, if you do have a product already manually added on Shopify, you can then actually link your Shopify product onto a product on SendJob so that you can then actually take advantage of the auto fulfillment option right here. Under issues, you're then going to see refunds and so on. SendJob does actually also offer refunds for all of their products. So basically, you aren't really going to have a lot of troubles with that. However, right here, as you can see, there is also the branding option. Now, this actually by far is one of my favorite favorite features of SendJob as a whole. So let me actually go over that. Now SendJob does actually offer you to brand all of your orders by adding custom packaging and custom thank you cards. Now, this is super valuable in my opinion because this can actually significantly improve and actually elevate your brand identity, which will then in return uh, actually result in more returning customers, more sales and so on. And basically like this, your customers are going to have a more branded and premium feeling. So this by far is one of my favorite features when it comes to SendDrop. And then SendDrop does actually also offer bundles and boxes. This will basically just be similar to, for example, HelloFresh, where you can then actually set up a monthly subscription. This will actually be super useful to set up monthly recurring revenue. So if you would want to do that, you can just click on create subscription box and then you will have to actually set up a name and you will then actually have to set up a bundle and so on. First of all, you can then... And you would actually have to, first of all, create a bundle. So let's, for example, say that we do want to add our lamp onto this right here. Uh, and we can then select these three, four lamps, let's go with them. And we can then actually name this. Let's say we are going to make a lamp bundle. <laughs> I don't know who would purchase this, but you're getting my, my point, I guess. I'm going to create this. And now we can then actually create the subscription box for this lamp bundle. So I'm just going to click on create right here going to name this something random and now we do have this available and we can then actually sell this on our store. And then SendDrop does actually also have the AliExpress import function. And a lot of people don't really understand how this actually works. Well, first of all, as we've already discussed beforehand, SendDrop does have a quite big product catalog with over 1 million products. However, still, if the product that you want to dropship isn't on SendDrop, you can actually just simply import your product onto SendDrop using an AliExpress link. However, it is really important to understand, as they also state right here, they only use the AliExpress link to actually gather product details and they will then actually source your product directly to manufacture 
direct, uh, directly from manufacturers basically, which means that they will basically reach out to their agents, to their manufacturers and so on. And they will then actually get your product most likely for a cheaper price than on AliExpress with faster shipping. So this also is a feature which I personally really like and a lot of people just think that they're going to source the product from AliExpress, whereas that really isn't the case. Now, actually, as for the trending products feature, um, to be honest, this is a nice to have. I don't really use this too much because I think there are just better ways out there to do product research by, for example, creating a TikTok burner account by, for example, doing product research with AdSpice. Um, so I personally haven't really used this too much. However, this still is a feature that is nice to have, I guess. Now, that's basically it for Sendrop. If you do want to sign up to Sendrop, once again, my link is down below. As always, if you do have any questions, make sure to leave them in the comments down below and I will try to get back to you as soon as possible.